and we are back. Today's map is going to be Konesburg. We got 60 second turn timer, expert app, progressive cards, balance blitz dice, no alliances, no fog, no portals. But we do have blizzards. We are the white player in the second position. And every time I play this map, I end up with the whale bonus, and I am nowhere to be seen in the bottom portion of this map. We are 100% in the northern region, and we got some crazy looking blizzards. The whale is actually a one guard, turns into an Australia instead of a South America. We have a ton of material here. Black is actually hedging out of it potentially to go for the middle, which would be a really good play for him. Um... This is a two guard for three that I actually really like. However, I got seven here, and that means 13 here. Plus five, not very plausible to hold. Plus four, a little bit too close to the middle. I think I start moving over here. I think I lock this pink in. Yes, I'm going to roll pinky next turn. Sorry, Pink. That one's donezo. All right. I'm going to get that two guard for three. I kind of like that. If Pink puts in there and slams me, that's just ridiculous. I think you just say goodbye to those three men, and I know what it's like, and I know what it means to you. But I'm going to get that bonus. I think that was my best play. I just don't really like the holds on all of these. I think we take advantage of that blizzard. Because then this one bleeds into a lot of territory. This one, not so much. And then pink goes ahead and caps on this. Okay. I should be able to hit this and fortify that three in. Then I have extra sources here. Pink does not take the bonus right away. Good man. Interesting. Oh, wait. I was still in it. Yeah, he couldn't take that. Okay. We should be able to get a plus three on turn two. I do like how this is shaping up. Let's see what purple, orange, and red do. Red is heavy in this sea lion bonus. Um, purple's going to get the whale bonus turn one, have a one guard, but then he's stuck behind red's bonus. So we might see some conflict of interest there. Hmm. Uh, this is going to be really interesting to see how red and purple interact. Best case scenario is red lets him stay behind him, uh, but purple actually doesn't want any part of it. So it looks like whoever wins this battle will get the whale and the sea lion. Um, orange could go here. Orange could go here. Orange literally has a one here, actually. I think orange goes here a four for four. No. Puts all five there and is going to scarf this up. Don't hit me, please. Thank you. Oh, he's going to reel this in across the pond yes interesting so he completely leaves and now we have red purple and orange all here as well as pink that only leaves me and black in the northern region orange completely suiciding all of their troops what happened they were looking so good this guy's name is smart but i don't believe that was very smart and that's exactly where black wanted to go so that's going to be a conflict of interest as well Red puts in, going to slam the purple three. Yes. And now purple's 11 is trained on him. I don't think anyone is reading the room here. I think everyone is kind of really invested in their own personal interest. And purple's going to slam that. Why wouldn't purple? Oh, red is playing a dangerous game of chicken right now. Black's going to put in. And now black's going to actually pivot for this plus five instead of the plus four. Never mind. He goes behind orange and breaks him for interrupting his bridge bonus what is this game interesting all five players are kind of uh slamming each other around and they're kind of forgetting about me which is good um hmm. okay I think I just roll this. We only lose one. That's phenomenal. I'll bring that in. Okay. That's really clean. Ooh, maybe should have fortified that and left that there to slow down pink. Mm, pink could go for this now. That wasn't smart. Should have left my three. But black is a breaker. Let's see if anyone else is a breaker right out the gate. Yeah, he has to get perfect dice. So let's see if he's got it. Minus one. Nope. Minus one. 
He's got it. Oh, he fails. That's amazing. That is crippling for pink, but amazing for us. They wouldn't have been able to hold it anyway. They still would need this one. But that was pretty fun to watch. A very dominant opening here for us. Oh, pink bots out after that display. Okay. I need to try to rescue those troops. Wow. Okay. So I can actually hold from here and here. That's going to be our play. That will be a plus five and almost a plus six. It'll be a plus five and almost a plus six. Now I could take that and then stay open here. Um, if I take that and hold here, I, I really like this. Okay. Let's see if I can get to work on that. Let's see if I can get to work on that. Pink is the bot. So we got to watch out. And purple slams red. Absolutely. It writes itself. It writes itself. Nobody cared to read the room. Everyone just took what they wanted and said, oh, I don't care if you're there. <laughs> wow, Cohensburg is popping right now. Very interesting to me. Orange takes the bridge now, and then black hits orange again. <laughs> what is this game? Bro, what is happening? Oh my, does Red bot out or does he try to take vengeance? Oh, sorry about that. Red takes back what is his and plumps up and rolls it again. Deja vu? This feels like deja vu. Wow. This is intriguing to me. He's going to hit it. And then he's going to plump up. And both of them lost a tremendous amount of troops there. Okay. Black does history repeat itself. Ooh, okay. Red learned. He's like, okay, if you're going to break me, don't hurt me. Okay. Don't hurt all of my troops. Take your own bonus. Black is just going to slam orange. Is he not? No one is changing their methods as the game progresses. Everyone's staying in a one-track mind saying, I want this. I have big stick. I hit hard. Like, come on, man. He's Is he going to take the bonus or is he going to roll orange? He rolls orange. Man. Vicious. Absolutely vicious. He gets it. He might be able to hold it, too. Wow. Black is definitely the best player so far. Definitely the best player so far. I don't want to lose these. I'm going to plump those. I like that. Only lose one there is really big for us. All right, now we have an extended two guard, and we're going to start working on this. I really like that. I put extra troops here just to disincentivize Pink from hurting us since he is a bot now. Now Pink's going to do some work here. Very nice. Wow, purple almost dead. Red almost dead. Orange almost dead. Pink is a bot, so it's black or bust. And Pink loses another 3v1. Does he win this one? Yes, he does. Very nice. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Okay, purple comes in. Rolls the three or breaks red. He's actually, this is an interesting position because you are stuck behind red, but if you break him, his seven comes at you. If you don't break him, he gets an extra three troops that he can then use to slam you. It's kind of a catch 22 position for purple now. But he did engage in the war when he didn't have to. It's just this whale bonus is bad news. It really is, and it always beckons to me, and I'm just glad we didn't get stuck there this game. It's really cool that we got the top part of the map. I really wanted to switch things up with this one. We are in a dominant position, but black is closer to making kills than we are, so we gotta watch out for that. Black has perfect lines on red. Per like, black is in the middle. He can kill anyone. I don't know if black is good enough. Purple bites the bullet. Does he break? He still breaks. Oh, man. Okay, purple and red are going to die together. Look at that. All three of these guys have no troops left. Uh, orange player was smart and is a bot. Now we have an orange bot as well as a pink bot. That's not good. Yes, it hits pink instead. That's amazing. Oh my god, we really lucked out there. So orange bought it out. Pink bought it out. Nobody can hang. Pink was Magnolia Hero. Purple is Josephine Gonzalez, who we just played with, did we not? Last match. Um... Then we had General Cartwright, and then we have Tiger Catalyst 15 for the black player. Okay. 
Just need my stacks big enough to where orange can't kill me. Okay. Okay, I think what we do is we hit this, form it in, and then orange will take that back most likely. <laughs> yeah, I like that. But kills are going to start happening very soon if this keeps up. Ooh, red is dangling by a thread. Black gets the big plus four in the middle, though, which is tough. Just kind of tough. He puts in there. He's going to go for a second bonus right next to the bot. Is he going to break? Is he going to break? Is he going to take? Yep, he takes for himself. Does He He breaks the bot so the bot doesn't break him smart. Ooh, he's going to get greedy for three? No, okay. The bot could still break him. Pink very, very may well break him there. All right. Okay. Okay. We lose two on that one. All right, now we're looking better. I like that. We're going a little bit slow, a little bit careful. We do not have a set on four, but we're looking really good. My, my losing play here is black to string all of the kills together which is very possible very very possible that it happens but if black if black is good we could lose this game if black is not good i think we have this one pretty much in the bag we'll see what happens here purple has to break red now and they set for an insurance now our set's going to be bigger on five orange is almost dead we kill orange next turn here unless black beats us to it. Ooh, orange could also set and get off the cards. It's it's actually better if everyone sets here so black can't kill them, I think. Orange sets on three. Look at that. Orange sets on three. Slams me. Ooh, that was close. That was very close to slamming my ten. Okay, it's going to hit the one. Hopefully it doesn't hit my five. Yes, if it hits the three. Okay. All right, that's good. That nine's a little intimidating, but we'll be fine. We will be A-OK. -okay. Our bonus is intact. We just keep flirting with the bot. Okay, it splits a little bit. Now our five is in trouble. Okay. Red sets and now he's going to eat purple. Uh, he's going to try to kill him, I think, for one car. Uh, that's not smart. Yeah, it's the principle, though. Yep. And he might get it. He might get it. It looks like it. Yep. He's going to get it for one card. Yes. Okay. And now black kills red for two cards. And all of that bonus. Oh my God. Black is going to have everything here. He's going to have the entire Southern map. Ooh, I'm going to have to break black here. I'm going to have to run out here and just trim black down. He's getting too big. Ooh, that was a fail though. He can't kill red now. He can only go up. That was a big fail. I think he thought that connected. It does not. Now your 13 is stuck. Now your 11 is stuck. Yep. He misplayed really badly there. Hopefully pink sets and slams him. Ooh, black. Okay, black is not good, but that's a lot of troops. Oh. Where do you put that? Ooh, okay, I think I break black. I think I sneak up behind black and break him. Now, if I do that, he's going to reroute on me, right? But he's going to kill red if I don't. He's going to kill red either way, I think. I think this is my moment to, to stab uh, black or kill pink. I could kill pink, actually. Kind of. That's kind of tight, is it not? I'll do it. I'll kill Pink. Okay. That punches my ticket to get Black as well. Okay, that way Black can't scarf that kill up. It's a double set. It's not a lot of troops. Oh, that is quite a bit of troops. Ooh, can I kill Black? Ooh, I would really like to kill Mr. Bon. Yeah, he says good luck. 
Oh, I might go for it. I might have it. Oh, I don't have it. No. Hmm. I don't have it. Okay. Oh, I got deer in the headlights at the end there. Orange goes here. I got a little bit deer in the headlights. So I have a set on three. I do not. Oof. Okay, we might lose now. We may lose now because red's going to be on three. Black kills red and then sets. Oh, we might lose because of that now. Okay. Now, if I kill orange, I set. I need red to go god mode on black. Oh, if he passes, that would be amazing. Yes, yes, yes. That is so big for us. That is so big for us. Red passes. Now black can't set. So he's going to go for the orange kill. What's he doing? You won't set here. Interesting. He's going to go for the red and orange kill. Okay. He needs to get god dice 12, 11, 10. He, might, he has to get god dice on this 7. I like it though. I like it. Big play. Big play for a big guy. He needs god dice, bad dice, bad dice, bad dice. Ooh, it's going to be so tight, dude. He's risking it all on a 9v7. And he gets it. 3v1 fail. Oh my god. GG. GG. Oh, wow. That was a very close call. Wow, black is actually better than I gave him credit for. Incredible attempt there. Incredible attempt there. Wow. That was phenomenal. Okay. I kill red. I set. And then I kill black. Okay. All right, perfect. We got it. We got it. We got it. We got it. All right, we set. That should be enough. That's enough there. That comes in here. I just need four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Give me 13. I think that's enough. Should be enough. Perfect. Uh, can I get this? No. Might have to split here. Oh my god, just enough. I think Black was a hidden OP, man. He was pretty decent. He was pretty decent. That was way, way, way closer than I thought, but I called it. I was like, if we're going to lose, it's going to be the black stringing kills. And he was that close. He was that close. He was a beginner. Fantastic beginner, sir. Great job. Everyone was beginner or novice. We take it. As always, thank you so much for your time. I really do appreciate it. And I will catch you on the flip. Peace.